So Ryan Martin winning the first race he's in for Mega Cash Days. Unfortunately, though, for No Prep Kings right now, he hasn't had too much success. He made it to the quarterfinals this past week, which was good, but a lot of people have been saying Ryan's underperforming for what we've seen him do in the past. And I saw a lot of people leaving some comments on some recent videos that I said that a lot of it was the rule changes, because I believe there were some rule changes with the tires and stuff, and that impacted a lot of big-name drivers, specifically Ryan Martin. And they're going through growing pains right now from trying to just simply figure it out and get used to all the new stuff and the changes that have been made for this season. Because he's putting his car in the best competitive advantage, in the best spot to have the best competitive advantage. And it might take him a little bit to figure out how to be competitive with that. I assume Ryan, if anyone, will be able to bounce back and figure it out. But I can't help but not notice and pay attention to what we saw last season. We saw Ryan Martin do very, very good at the start. And then the second half of the season, he just he just couldn't figure it out. And he hung on to that number one spot because of his success earlier in the season. Now, we're seeing it to where he's starting off struggling without success. So, is he going to be able to bounce back? Or is he going to continue to just not be able to figure it out like it's ryan martin you'd think he'll figure it out like i hope ryan figures it out because i want to see him up there battling with the fastest guys if there is a new no prep kings champion after ryan martin has his three peat i would want to see ryan martin going at it with that guy at least i want to see that guy beat ryan martin i don't want to see that guy win because ryan martin simply just couldn't figure it out the whole season but if that's the case man it is what it is at the end of the day and it'd be unfortunate for Ryan Martin and just no prep Kings as a whole if he isn't one of those top main guys. But I have faith in Ryan Martin. I think he'll figure it out as the season goes on. We're in the July break right now when they come back. Hopefully he comes out swinging after the July break in the middle of August there. But if he comes out after July and is still just struggling, 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 it might be official, everyone. The Ryan Martin era might be over for no prep Kings as we know it. I mean, based on the stuff that's been going on so far this season.